testing, testing. Hello, welcome back to another episode of DKT Gameplay. How y'all doing out there? I'm doing good. Let me know if you can hear everything okay. If you can hear me okay. What's up, Mr. Steady Cat? Thanks for joining. Thanks for joining, man. Can you hear me okay? Yo, what's up, Max Max? Can y'all hear me okay? Good, all right. Thank you, thank you, sir. Let me get this started off here. Solo queue night, solo queue. There we go. It's gonna take a long ass time. What's up, Psycho Gamer? How you doing, man? What's up, man? How you doing? Ain't heard from you in a while. How's the channel doing, man? You still streaming? Still streaming, Psycho? Uh, I hear you, man. I hear you, man. I pick up the mantle where you left off, good buddy. Yeah, make sure you take care of your family. Take care of everything first before you get back into it. 
I feel the same way from before you though. It's uh, Paragon in a good and bad spot right now. It's hard to it's hard to uh, like it. I, I mean, I, I, I used to love it, but it's getting harder and harder every day to like it. But um, I, I still enjoy it. It's still my favorite game. So I just wish they would balance some stuff a little bit more and acknowledge some of the things that's going on in the community. But um, I wonder who I should be. Uh, who am I going to be? No, he's not going twin, but oh, come on. Here we go. Here we go with this solo cute bullshit. Here we go. <laughs> oh, this should be fun. Twin Blast, Murdoch. Twin Blast, we're about. Yeah. I mean, they. I think mean, they're trying their best, but, you know. Yeah, I mean, he wasn't going to pick still. I don't know why he didn't pick him yet, but. Someone's going to draft a board. I'm just waiting for it. There it goes. He probably walked away. <laughs> I feel bad. I just gave him a bath. <laughs> Dick move. Force that draft aboard. Uh, welcome, welcome. We got five people in here. Welcome. So what you um what you gonna be playing, Psycho, if you're still around, man? What you what you think about playing next? Overwatch, okay, okay. Hmm. I used to play Overwatch a lot when it first came out. And then I, I just stopped playing. I, I I have it for Xbox. That's the thing. Like, I mainly play. Well, I play main. I play all. I play now is PS4, but all my games and stuff within the last, you know, then I, within that came out within the last year or two are all on Xbox. So. Like all my main games I was playing, I was on Xbox up until I started playing Paragon again on PS4. And so then I just started buying everything on PS4. No, not all night, JJ. But um, I'm going to play one game, two, probably two games, solo queue, JJ. Or maybe one. And then I'll get you in here. I'm just, uh, you, uh, you can jump in here with me, uh, JJ. It's fine if you join me.
Yeah, man, it's been at um, this. It's it's actually it's been. I mean, even though it looks like I'm growing because it's over 600, I've, I've actually been at like a standstill. Um, I get people unsubbing every day. People sub every day. Like, uh, believe it or not, I've lost 78 subscribers in the last month and a half. Um, people just aren't watching uh, as much either. That's why I got the bot and stuff and, like, try to create, like, the betting and stuff and the coins. Like, people just aren't watching. I, I think it's just because people just isn't interested in, um, I was about to say Pokemon. People isn't interested in Paragon anymore. Uh, so... You know, you get shit like this. I've, I've been streaming for 12 minutes, haven't gotten to a match. Granted, we probably could have gotten that first one, but but yeah, man. So it's uh, it's the channel. Like last month and a half, I made like fourteen dollars. This month, I'm barely cracking five. Uh, just people just aren't isn't watching. People aren't showing up to the stream, or and then. The whole ad thing is really messing messing up the channel right now. Like, I want to, like, move everybody over to Twitch. Move everybody over to Twitch so they can watch me on there. So Twitch can, you know, I can get recognized on there and have some more people come through. Um, other now, I'm probably going to start streaming, like, Smite. Get into some other games. Um, and try to try to grow that way. And have a you know a, a night dedicated uh, to every game. But yeah, man. For I've been this is probably the slowest uh, milestone from a hundred to a hundred subscribers. Like I've been doing my goal, my goal every uh, month or so is a hundred subscribers. I've been at, I've been in the 600s for almost two months now, cause uh, just people keep desubbing, resubbing. Like I can see everybody that that unsub and desub and that likes the video, that dislike the video because of the program, because of the partnership I'm in. I'm in uh, with Curse Gaming, so I can see all the activity, what's going on, and it's like I get like 15 people that sub and unsub and that sub and unsub and just like it just all it's doing is hurting the channel um and with them just de-subbing and subbing you know and then the dislikes that i'm seeing i'm just like i don't throw it out there and and like tell people that they don't like it but like I see the same people like I have consistently uh, eight people that come in that that does nothing but dislikes nothing. Like every day. Hopefully we can get into a game. Champion squad. That's actually a Paragon music, dude. <laughs> That's the Paragon music. That's not my music. <laughs> it is. It's 
is very dramatic, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Oh, you changed yours to hype? Yeah. Jungler has no purpose now. What? That's not true. Watch this match, bro. I'll show you what Jungler can do. I'll put the faith back in again. I make Paragon fun for you again. Let Dark King Titan stick to the light. Look at that big, beautiful orb up in the sky. Oh, orb, Lord, we come to thee. Allow our harvest to be fruitful. Allow us to strike fear in the hearts of our enemies so the tip of our blades will pierce their souls. And allow us to bathe in that ooey, gooey, sticky, icky, ooh. Orb juice. Boom. Boom. Everybody now. Boom, baby! The ritual is complete. Let's go. You gonna learn today. <laughs> you gonna learn today. It's gonna be fun. So, when I'm in the jungle here, for those of you that are new, just now coming back, we like to start off. We take out these two, and then we will take out the green buff, and then we will rotate over. And get our, uh, um, we might be rotating a little early if, uh, this shit be done calm the, calm the hell down. Look at her. Look at her. And she, and she just keep going. She just keep tugging along. She gonna come back too. Oh my goodness. Is this child okay? No, she is not. Oh my goodness. Sorry about that. Fuck, you should have. You need some help. That's what you need. This Faye is going to play smart too because now that she knows this Shimbi is ultra aggressive and suck, it's going to be <laughs> it's going to be dangerous. All right, so that's one mistake right there. I think that I'll start by clearing. I think I'll start by clearing these four camps first. It didn't take me that long to take them. And here we go. <sighs> okay. Oh, shit. Fucking steal. Great. Well, that happened. There we go. It's gonna be one of those games, right? Yep. It's gonna be one of those games. Hopefully we can turn it down. Yeah, it still feeds your team. The jungle is still feeds the team. This dude, what is he doing? What is he doing? Don't you try to shoot me, god damn it. Oh my god, kill him, please. Wow. He throws his sword out there. He throws his sword out, but he doesn't come and follow up. He 
throws his sword out, but he doesn't come and follow up. He had all that energy, all that life left, but he don't come and follow up. Like, what the... Like, now it's a little too late for that, buddy. Now he's about to die, because Chimera's gonna come out of nowhere and kill him. Look at that shit. Wow. Oh my goodness. This is uh, for high 1400 cap elo too. Dumbasses. And she won't go back. Go back. What? God damn. What's wrong with her? She got no goddamn mana. No nothing. Go back. Chill out. Trying to do too much. We're seven minutes into the damn match. So I can quit my shit. Let me get a hundred more. Oh. All right, brother. I'll catch you later. Thanks for stopping by, man. Don't forget to like that video, please.
This dude just left. Wow. Look at this. Dude should be dead. Dude should be dead. You see that shit? You see that? Dude just took like, what, 12 tower shots? 12? 12 tower shots he just took? Both of them? <laughs> That's kind of broken right there. That is, I won't lie about that. And now he's unstoppable. God damn. God damn. Come on, y'all. Y'all just got beat by Rafe and Faye. That's some grade A shit right there. She is not smart for not going back. He stayed. Why he stayed, I don't know. I don't know why she stayed. Like, let me check this damn ELO cap and just make for sure I'm playing with all people that's in go. I don't think I am. I don't think I am. I think this Shimby got a few marbles screwed on. Uh, they're just a little loose. Someone's in Viz right here. Someone's in Viz. I'm dead. Yep. I'm dead. So no one came and helped me mid. They see mid getting taken. Fucking stupid dude. Huh. <sighs> So instead of instead of protecting the tower, he tries to shoot Murdoch in the tower while he still is beating the tower ass. Like, what's the what, explain to me the logic to that? What is the logic? You could have got a kill sitting right there in front of you, but instead you chose you chose you chose to whoop his ass. You chose to whoop his ass. Instead of killing what was right in front of you, this squirmy little motherfucker. Come on, girl. I stopped him for you. Are you gonna kill him? You got your ult? Something? Oh, Jesus.
don't even want it. You don't want it. I don't want. I don't have the mana. If I had the mana, I would have fought it, but I didn't have the mana to fight it, so I didn't want it. Take my green buff. gonna run that way <laughs> Murdoch oh my god oh my god we deserve to lose this game the fucking Murdoch he running every way but the fucking right way trying to sandwich me in and shit. Come on, bitch. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, bitch. Come on. Don't you run away from me, bitch. Bitch. Lucky I ain't got my shit on. Surprised we've been able to keep these second two towers over here is very surprising. Oh, they did take my green buff, dirty bitches. Come towards me, baby. Come on, you're running the wrong fucking way. God damn. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> her dumb ass. All she had to do was run towards me. I could have protected her. So she could have got away. Oh my fucking goodness. You sure you wanna fight me again, huh? Are you sure you wanna fight me again, you dumb bitch? Oh, now you're gonna try to kill me. So stupid ass over here, you dumb bitch. Yeah, she got me. Wow. Wow. She was able to do all that. I couldn't do shit to her. Where the fuck is everybody at? Aurora, nobody came.
They see they see the mid tower getting hit. How she then how she didn't exhaust all her mana, I don't even fucking know. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. You had to freeze her? Seriously? You had to freeze her? You got a fucking what's he got? Mm, that makes sense. Look, instead of him going up there to take the tower, knowing someone's gonna be there to protect it, I guess it, maybe I might get it. Yeah, I got it. At least these guys are smart enough to ward the fucking prime when they have to. I'm out. I'm out. Nice. Attack mid now. Oh, y'all ain't got no help. That come out. That chimera I fucking eat them for breakfast. He about to go eat he might go eat some lunch. They dead. Yep, Rafe coming to clean up the mess. Yep, 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 yep. I don't know why she came back. Murdoch taking his sweet ass fucking time. You ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. Lucky bastard.
dumb bitch. Hey, what's up, bro? No hoes. <laughs> Got good souls and lick booty hoes. I don't know about that. You ever just rage in Paragon? Heck, I do all the time, but I I rage all the time. Hey, we got 14 people in here. Please drop a like down below. It goes a long way to supporting the channel. Appreciate all the feedback that you give me. If you drop a dislike, please leave some. Let me know what's going on. And again, just play Smite when 33 and two. Wow. <laughs> and hated it in Paragon. Definitely best mobile in my opinion. Well, no, I try not to. Sometimes I get raged in the heat of the moment, but for the most part, I, I try not to rage. The fuck? Look, he doing it again. He doing it again. What are you doing? Fuck! You sit up there. You got targets right in front of you, and you trying to kill one that's in the distance. Fucking mercy. See, that's what I mean about rage in the moment. It's just stupid shit like that, you know. <laughs> what the fuck is he doing? What is he doing? He got a fucking perfect target right there, brother. There's a perfect one right there in front of you. You up there fucking trying to shoot somebody you ain't gonna hit in the distance. Like, what the fuck? Oh, great. Now this bitch. Oh. Great, I'm dead now. This fucking bitch doing that. She's doing that much fucking damage. That's stupid. Fucking bitch. <laughs> yeah, that is true. Yeah, I don't think I don't think Paragon touches from what from the five on five and stuff that I played, uh, and what you hate about it, please explain. I think he's talking to you, him again. But uh, like the five v five matches on fucking Smite are so awesome. Those damn things get heated. I like playing those. Um. Oh my god, dude, you didn't even tether him. What the fuck is you doing? Oh wow. How Chimera was able to activate the Orb Prime by himself, I don't even fucking know. I don't give a damn how strong he is. He should have not been able to do that by himself, especially with not building a health gear. That's the bullshit right there. That's major bullshit. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Fucking moving slow as fuck. Miss me, bitch. Could nobody move in that in that moment? Cause could nobody move in that moment? Cause everybody running what? Plague Lord. Fucking can't move at all. Fuck this shit up. I can't believe that Murdoch's on the Mega Street. How many times he saved his ass? Oh 
Oh my fucking god. Look at this shit. Come on, Murdoch, clean him up, man! Oh, you ain't doing shit now. Wow. <laughs> I provided Murdoch with slow. I provided him with all of that. He couldn't even clean this shit up. Wow. Just wow. <sighs> hey, what's up, bro? <laughs> oh, now y'all want to give up. You want to give up now? Game up a long motherfucking time ago. What did I get? Did I get a fucking key? No? Did I get the key? Okay, I got the key. Oh, hell yeah, son. I wanted that. I wanted that one. We're gonna play that. Yeah, we're gonna play that. Hey, we got 20 people up in here. If you're enjoying the content, please drop a like down below. Appreciate it. it goes a long way to support the channel. We're gonna go ahead. We're gonna get this kicked off with another steel one. Uh, I'm gonna go left lane this time. I'm gonna go left lane this time and uh, see if we can uh, if we can make some shit happen on left lane um, because I don't know I thought the jungler was okay but they just I don't know it, it was just that last match that fucking Shinbi was a wild child with a cut running around with her head cut off didn't know what the hell was going on oh that still looks sexy I like this one this is like this is like my favorite color. So like this, uh, I love this color on him. Looks so damn good. Looks so good. <laughs> Look at that. Fucking looks awesome. I almost own all the steel skins. I need these two. Oh, I didn't know this one. This one looks awesome too. Look at this. Got that one. Need these two. Those two. We got a green one like this. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Oh, we got a Richter jungle. We might actually have a solid team here, y'all.
No, count, no. No. No, please pick a different hero. No. I'll go fucking jungle, you can go left. No. No. Don't do this, man. <sighs> My god, please don't pick counters, dude. Pick, come on, man. Pick, pick somebody else or I can go jungle. There we go. I'll go jungle then. <clears throat> Um, actually, Paragon actually does play quite smooth, dude. Paragon plays pretty smooth. Um, as far as, like, he's talking about when you get into, like, big-ass team fights and stuff. It does play pretty smooth. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Alright, y'all. We like to start off every game with the ritual. O oh, Orb Lord, we come to thee. Allow our harvest to be fruitful. Allow us to strike fear in the hearts of our enemies so the tip of our blades will pierce their souls and allow us to bathe in that ooey, gooey, sticky, icky, ooh, orb juice. Boom! Boom! Everybody now. Boom! The ritual is complete, baby. Let's go. We have Revenant in the off lane. This is gonna be great. Oh no, he's in mid lane. He's in mid lane. Let me go ahead and pop somebody here. <laughs> you know, we're gonna feast tonight. <clears throat> yeah, that revenant's gonna be my bitch tonight. He's gonna be, be my bitch. Yeah, get your ass out of here. <laughs> Holy shit, what? Wow, that was dumb, dude. That was dumb. You see all those other fucking minions there? Uh, of course he gets a lock on when there's like 17 other fucking minions there. Like... That shit never happens for me. Never happens for me. I will get your ass, Revenant. I'll be back in a moment. I'm gonna get my green buff. I'm coming in and smash your shit. That was so stupid. Of course he get he gets a lock on when we got all those damn minions there in the mid. But then then they 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 just so happily his arrows and shit was all just on me, huh? That bullshit. What you need help on left for? We two minutes into the goddamn match. What you need help for? Oh, the motherfucker's in this. Oh, there we go. Wow. <laughs>
Uh, yeah, I think Car Paragon did have identity with the old card system, I believe. They, they, the old card system, like, all they had to do is, I, I feel like all they had to do is tone back the numbers some with the, with the fucking crits and all this shit. Like, the old card system was all about being crit. Crit this, crit this. You saw crit on every goddamn hero, um... And it was just ridiculous, you know, like, the old car system was was how they identified themselves uh, from other people. Go. Where the fucking help at from Rafe? Jesus. All right, I'm gonna just stop going out till I get to level five. It's fucking ridiculous. Like. Fucking one and three and five minutes in the damn game. This fucking Rafe is scared as fuck of this uh of this goddamn revenant for whatever reason I don't under fucking stand. Like it's just ridiculous. You shouldn't let fucking revenant push up that far. All you have to do is keep poking his ass and then you just let him push up that fucking far. What are you doing? My fucking god, look at this shit. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Where's Rafe at? What are you doing? Oh my fucking god. Oh. This is the same dumbass that was in the last game with me. These are the same damn people. I'm getting the same damn game with the same fucking people, dude. With the same fucking people I'm getting the same game with. Fuck me, dude. Oh. Great. Look at this shit, man. What is rape? It's fucking Sparrow. It's fucking Sparrow and oh my god. Fucking do something. Fuck me. You better back her up, you dumb shit. Don't you retreat, you piece of shit back her up oh my fucking god oh uh, see this shit like that make me want to fucking rage like aurora where the fuck is she where the fuck is aurora at she not dead
No, man, I'm good, dude. I'm fucking... Back her up, dummy. Back her up. Back her up. There you go, Revenant. What? What? Wow. 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 Is he is he not gonna help? He not gonna help. He not gonna help. Wow. Wow. He just up and leave. You see this shit? He just ups and leaves. Ups and leaves mid. Just just leaves it. Just leaves him mid. They can't even take down the left lane from Kalari. It's fucking Kalari, dude. It's Kalari. All you have to do is push up minions against this dumb bitch. Like, like, come on, man. Fuck me, dude. Fucking pieces of shit. 15 minutes in. They, they, it's 14 and 6. 14 and 6, wow.
Really? Don't follow that, dumbass. It's a trap. Where's Aurora at the help? The Aurora didn't even, she see me fighting her, doesn't even come down there to help. The bitch turns around and goes back. Insane. Turns around and goes back. Just stupid, dude. Just so dumb, man. So dumb. Hey, what's up, uh, Stefan? How you doing, man? All we had to do in the first place is just group up, take out fucking Revenant, take out the mid.
Jesus. Wow. The enemy is unreal. Who is a Kalari? Of course it is. We're gonna try another one. We'll try another one. Won't be somebody else this time. Because apparently all the revenue need is possess breaking to make them invincible. It's fucking ridiculous, dude. <clears throat> What's up, man? How you doing? Can y'all not hear me? <laughs> you should be able to hear me. You should be able to
Oh, okay. Just want to make for sure. He, he didn't seem like he can hear me, so. He said hello twice now. Stefan did. Never give up, never. Hey, I feel you, man. Uh, <laughs> I feel you falling, man. Here, I'll go ahead and play with some people, man. Might as well. Might as well. Why not? Anybody else that want to join? Uh, yeah, I'm in our, I'm all right. I'm all right. Just, um, I don't know. A knocks back. Uh, I mean, it's what it is, what it is, man. Uh, you on the Discord? Okay. Let me jump in the Discord. Hey, what's up, brother? It, I don't know, man. Like, the solo, you saw what happened. This dumb shit. Oh, yeah, there won't be a delay. Yeah. Uh, we get up in here falling. I don't know if him again wants to join. Juggernaut. J. Why not? Send them all in, but... <laughs> you funny, Joe. <laughs> I played some of that Star Wars, man. That Star Wars was fun. Uh, all right, he left. I guess it's just me and you falling. We'll go into it. Uh, yeah, it was, uh, I didn't play a lot of it. I played some of it, though. I, I didn't see you. I haven't seen you online, man. I was playing, I was trying to do the Destiny. 
I was trying to do the, the raid in the nightfall today, but I got online. I posted in the community. I posted inside the clan. I was like, hey, I need help with the nightfall. Anybody willing to help me? Nobody. Nobody came out. So I was like, all right. Fuck it. I'll just wait for the next reset. Try to get some help then. Oh, okay. Yeah, I pretty much been on all day, man. Oh, this is the actual color of it, huh? I didn't know I had this color. Oh my god, Dragon I know, dude. Don't tell me. Don't tell me anything about the Dragon Ball Z Super. Oh my goodness. I've been waiting. I haven't seen anything since episode 97. I want to wait and I'm going to watch them all, man, cuz I just got to I can't I can't do this week to week thing. Like I always wait like with the Goku Black arc. Oh, I need to see <laughs> <laughs> the Goku Black Art, like I had to wait on that. I was like, I was watching the episode. No, I didn't wait on Goku Black. I watched episode after episode every single week, and I just like, I can't wait anymore. I gotta fucking know what happened, so I stopped. I stopped. Uh, what? Why is the message deleted? Why is the message? Uh, I don't know why your message was deleted, Joe. But yeah, so I stopped. I was like, I stopped. I'm stopping at uh, the last episode I saw. Uh, Krillin got knocked out. I don't know which episode that was, but he got knocked out and his wife got mad at him. So that was the last episode I saw. I think that was 96 or 95, I think. Alright, y'all, we like to start off every episode with the ritual. Oh, Orb Lord, we come to thee. Allow our harvest to be fruitful. Allow us to strike fear in the hearts of our enemies so the tip of our blades will pierce the souls. And allow us to bathe with that ooey, gooey, sticky, icky, ooh, Orb Juice. Boom! Boom! Everybody now. Boom! The ritual is complete. Let's go. I was watching Alley Lit. <laughs> I was watching Alley Lit and Fang Mao came running down. They were like, what in the hell? What the f was that? What in the f is that? <laughs> Yeah, this bitch. Boy. But watch what you're doing, girl. But watch what you're doing. What did I get here? I got armor. Oh. Damage reduction. Okay. Oh, she's trying hard. Look at her. So I'm gonna hit you. 
I'm gonna get you with my dagger, bitch. Bitch, you better say you may have a girl. You better make sure you save enough to uh, you better make sure you save enough to escape. Cause when I get that ass, I'm gonna tear you up. I meet some some uh, Kalari sushi. Let's see here. Yeah, if you watch more than five hours, dude, you got to account. You got to comment. I think that's what it goes by. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. You can come get this gank. Keep pushing up. Let's see here. We got enough for 80. We have 40. Wait for him to come up. I don't know why he didn't just run in the tower and let the green buff explode on her ass. That's all he should have. That's all he should have done is do that. Could have let the green buff explode on her. Um, that twin blast would have been dead. Wow, you let Tom Cruise escape? No, nah, man, I hit him. It just didn't do enough damage to him, dude. I definitely hit him, but it didn't do enough damage. Yeah, I definitely hit him. Just didn't do no damage to him. I wasn't about to die, though. I didn't want to die. That's why I didn't chase him. Because Kalari was looking to kill me. She was looking to pick me off when she came out of Invis. So. Uh, why solo queue? Uh, just, man. Just because. I, I ain't going to lie to you. I'm going to keep it real with y'all. Like, the people that I've been playing with, the teammates and stuff, man, they've just been arguing so damn much. And it's just, it gets frustrating. After when people don't listen, you know, I don't want to be a dick and just be like, hey, you're not welcome here. Or, you know, I don't want to play with you if, if you're going to argue. And it's just like, hey, like, let's 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 come together to fucking let's come together to uh, to have some fun. You know, like, let's do that. Like, like, you know what I'm saying? Like.
So, you know. So I'm just, uh, you, I never argue. Wait, that doesn't sound right. No, I'm not talking about uh, you, Huda. You, Huda, if you know that it doesn't apply to you, you know it doesn't apply to you. So it's not you. If you know it doesn't apply to you, Huda, hey, you know it doesn't. Like, it's just, it applies to, it applies to certain people. And, uh, oh, okay. Uh, so, you know, it's just like, hey, let me try out solo Q and play with people my actual ELO and see how that is and have some fun. But, you know, it's just like, you know, you kind of tell somebody like, hey, if you're going to do this, if you're going to play with me, let's play an actual, let's play people we could play with. If we're going to have fun and play people unorthodox, then let's do it. But let's, you know, come prepared to, you know, either get our asses whooped or actually play for real and not argue about every damn thing. So it's just, it's frustrating when, when um, you try to teach someone how to play the game and they continue not to listen or they continue, you know, just to, to be how they are. So, no, it doesn't make it, it doesn't make it fun to play with. <laughs> he was done. He was like, nope, fame out, nope, fame in the mouth, I'm out. <laughs> he was like, fame me out, I'm out. You going, you going. Where you going? Where you going? Where you going? <laughs> Fanging the meow, I'm out. Fucking little bastard. Oh, I didn't do. Let me uh, let me look at that. Let me look at that. Give me one moment. Let me look at that. Today, bitch. Trans, change your last video title from gaming. But gaming's a gaming, damn. Uh, I go solo Q mode sometimes. Split push sometimes, yeah. Uh, let's see here. Ooh, can't do that. We'll do that. Hey guys, if you're enjoying the video, please drop a like down below. It goes a long way to supporting the channel. Appreciate it if you would.
Yeah, that's what another thing I like solo queuing too. It was like, let me see my faults and roles that I uh, play. It let, lets me see my faults. Like in that last game, I could have done so much more at steel. Like I could have actually focused in the jungle and uh, took out a little bit more enemies in the jungle before trying to take on that Revenant um, in the, in the uh, mid. And I think that would have set us up nicely to win that game. But I got pissed off and I was too headstrong to realize what I was doing wrong. Um, and I just, I, that rage, you know, that just it keeps you keeps you preoccupied and um, not focused on the, on the task that's on hand. So um, that happens. Where you going, Kalari? Where you going? Where you going? Ooh. Ooh. I ain't going nowhere. Go ahead and take out these while I'm here. No! Mmm. Like that escape, baby? Ooh. Ooh. Candy. I like candy. I like candy. Give me some candy. Give me some candy. Candy girl. You're on my world. Your love so sweet. Baby, you make me complete. I don't know the words. Don't judge me. I like candy. <laughs> I need to stop. Where are they? Where'd they go? What's up, girl? Oh, shit. What the fuck the call out? Was it call out? Uh, oh, he was stealth. Thanks for the call. You called it out. You called it out. He was stealth. My bad. Someone needs to go left. Someone needs to go left. Come on, team. Stupid white dude. Yeah, that's yeah, that's true, man. Like my like my thing is like with that though, uh, shock is just like, dude, like, and that and that's that's part of the reason kind of why I'm solo queuing too is just because you know like, like I'll I'll be like, hey, this is what we need to change. Hey, y'all, this is what we need to change, y'all. Hey, come on, let's do it this way. Come on, let's do it this way. And it's just like, mm, uh, hey, I'm, I'm knocking on the door. Anybody listening? Nobody home. Like, that's what I feel like sometimes when I'm playing uh, with our members. And it's just like, like, hey, um, guys, we're doing one thing this way. It's not working. Come on, let's do it this way. And and no one's listening. So 
it's like, yeah, I just go silent because I get I get tired of him talking, like and saying the same thing. Like I feel like I'm talking to my damn nine year old sometime uh, with all the shit that I got to do, you know. So, you know, sometimes it's just, it just be that, man, you know, like, god damn, like. It's just be like, how many times? That's what I'm going to do right now. Sorry, it's taking me a while to try to focus and read, too. Stop him, stop him, stop him with your bow, stop him with your bow. trying to give up like come on the fuck am I in front of me like why would you even why would you even want to give up like the inhibitors are still up Enough of my special shoot have been done. Fucking twin blasters in our fucking jungle.
Oh, wow. my help at like Jesus fucking Christ wow just wow well. uh, thanks man I appreciate you stopping by Doing all right, man. Just losing in Paragon. That's all that's been happening. Stupid shit, dude. Why not, right? All right, Joe, see you later, man. Sorry about that. All my gold and one one thing. There you go. There we go. Uh, no, I'm playing with other people. Other people can join in if they want to. They could join in.
Oh, uh, no, it comes up. It comes up when you win, too. It comes up when you win. Not often, but it does come up. You say you gotten it once when it came up winner? I've, I've gotten it a couple times. A couple times. Yeah, I've gotten it a couple times. I'll be right back. I'm going to use the restroom. Give me one moment.
So let's see here. Yeah, that's pretty badass. Who was that supposed to be? That's for Sarah. She got a she ain't got a mace, dude. She got a she got a you giving her a sword. Oh, I know it's good, dude. I know it's good. I don't want to watch it just yet, though. <laughs> you don't go that far, man. <laughs> it's killing my nutsacks. You're not watching BBC Super. Was she like Pocahontas? She black? Damn. I'm 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 like I'm telling y'all with Dragon Ball Z Super that Archangel that dude is the evil dude he controlling those little kids he's the evil one and I think that uh what's what's the uh, God that watches over Paris the angel that watches over Paris 
That motherfucker evil too. Like, like he wants to tell you everything that's going on, but no one is asking the questions. Like, no one's asking the questions. Like, Beerus don't even ask him the questions. Like, he knew the the universe was going to get it, uh, messed up, but at the same time, he might he might be good because he started training Vegeta and Goku right away to prepare them for the universe is getting blown up. So he could be good. So we just don't have a mid lane then. Okay. <laughs> he dropped the board. I'll go mid. See, the thing is, the thing about that, that Jaren, like, him using a wish um, to stop Goku from ever meeting Beerus, that 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 will never stop. That, that, that's the inevitable that's just going to happen, because Goku will always seek the strongest opponent. He will always seek the strongest opponent. There will always be evil in the universe. So him meeting Beerus is inevitable. Uh, it's going to happen. Even if someone wish it to never happen, it will happen because Goku and Vegeta are always uh, are always seeking to be the strongest in the universe. So um, the wish that they should that they should uh, wish for would be either not giving the uh, universal God that much power or uh, stopping the. Uh, the universe from expanding or like so that way they can't blow it up or do something else or have these tournaments uh like something else to happen like but you know he can never not meet up with uh jaren that all of that stuff is going to happen Yeah, I, I would like to see Hit um, Hit Jaren and Goku. I thought Hit was gonna be like the All Star, like that dude's that dude's pretty amazing. Oh, here we go.
I don't know what's going on. We got Greystone as a jungle. Yen in the mid. Yen in the mid. Oh, shit. Yen's about to go up against the Iggy. Oh, shit. Oh, We're going to have to do our best, Queen, to take out the Iggy. <laughs> I'll just play safe. Okay.
Yeah, I would have been dead. Yeah, no doubt about that. My ass would have been a roasting duck. A roasting duck. Fucking left, stop crying. It's Christmas thing now, it's cooler. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just need to get one more in there and I'll start building into my other one here. Yeah, just one. you bitch come on I was being greedy that's what happens when you greedy mm, I need three more don't be greedy man
Damn, mid is gone. Yeah, but I, he was just going to chase me, so. Ain't nobody going to come out here and shoot him? Oh, wow. Come on, bitch. Revenant. Revenant and her. They just, all they had to do was just come out and hit him once. God damn. Come out and hit him once. That's all you had to do. Just come out and hit this man one time. One time, not twice, not just one time. That's all they had to do. Ah. Oh.
Revenant could have waited, put him in the alt, killed him, killed him that way. Come towards me again. Whenever you're in a fight, come towards the nearest ally. Come towards me. Fuck. Great. <laughs> oh, man. That was fun. It's all right. No, it... yeah. When you that low, that that time, Queen. When you that low, just run away. I mean, come towards me so I can fight them, but you run away. That way, you can come back and pick them off after you come from the healing. Oh, just leave. Just leave if you can. If you can get away. Look at the rotation from them. Their rotation on point. That Aurora hasn't showed up to a fucking team fight yet. She don't even believe in team fights. Shit, that shit ain't real. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I just I'm getting in here like <laughs> Queen. We just we getting in here with a bunch of uh, uh, nutcases. I don't even know. Like like <laughs> the roar. Like she's steady going right, but she could have came in, froze them all. We could have picked them all off just like that. Graystone. Don't know what he's doing. 
going left. They see the man pushing up. Could have picked them all off just like that. Easy fucking kills. Easy kills. Easy kills. Just simple, easy kills that we just, for whatever reason. Wow! Fucking dumb! Fucking both of them have stagnant. There you go, Aurora. About time you show up to a fucking team fight. It's stupid. Why your, why your, why your carry showing up to the team fight, but you not showing up to the team fight? So damn stupid, dude. Yeah, they ain't even been touched. Yeah. Nothing. Nope, they just kept pushing, man. Motherfuckers blind as a bat. Look at this shit. Iggy has been up here the whole fucking time. Right lane done. <laughs> Bitch put me in a static track. Wow. Straight put me in a static trap. That's wow. That's just amazing.
Oh my fucking god. Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. Jumped in there and did absolutely jack shit. Jumped in there and died. Wow. Wow. All right, clean. That's enough Paragon for me. I'm tired of this bullshit.
Hold the line. Don't fall to the Chaos Forces. The Phoenix has fallen. Our defenses aren't enough. I must call on help from the gods. Neith, the Egyptian weaver of fate, you have arrived just in time. Hurry, defend the phoenix until it respawns. Use the left and right stick to get there. Here comes a wave of enemy minions. Destroy them. Use the right stick to aim, then fire your bow when you're ready. Each time you slay an enemy or destroy an objective, you gain experience or XP. Gain enough XP and you will level up, allowing you to unlock abilities. Unlock Spirit Arrow, Neath's first ability. By default, your abilities will be trained automatically for you after this tutorial. Watch out! More enemies are approaching. You must use your powerful ability. Spirit Arrow is a line attack that can strike multiple enemies within its highlighted area. Use the targeter to help direct you when casting your abilities. With the targeter visible, press the button to fire. Phoenix has respawned. Excellent work. Head back to the fountain and let's prepare to advance. You've taken a lot of damage and need to replenish your health. Teleport back to the fountain now. Within the fountain, gods will rapidly gain health and restore their mana. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, how do you recall? I just run back or what? I didn't. I didn't. I wasn't paying attention to it. And I had to call. Uh, down on the direction button. Yeah, I pushed that. It ain't going back though. Do I just run back for night now or what? Wow, L2 and L3 to recall, really? Damn. Gold can be used to purchase items from your team's item store, but only while you are in your base fountain. And screen. L2, L3, screen. Go to store. Remembered list and shows items most likely to help you in your role. One of these items is Light Blade, which increases your damage and the speed of your basic attacks. Select the item Light Blade to purchase it. At level 1, you can choose your first relic. Relics can be used like abilities, but don't require mana. There are a wide variety of relics available, but for now we will be obtaining Meditation as our first relic. Select the relic icon, select Meditation, and then press the Purchase button. Finally, let's buy a consumable item. Unlike relics, consumable items can only be used once. Select the healing potion and put very good. These items will help you in your battles. Our 
tower is under siege. Go now! Your tower is under attack from enemy minions. Go there now and defeat them. Oh wow, so I jump by pushing in on the... Okay. Your middle tower is under attack. I jump by pushing in on, uh... Pushing in on the D-pad, or not the D-pad, but the, the C-stick. R3 jump. L1. Now it's time for payback. Push to the enemy tower. Remember to stay behind your minions so that they take the brunt of the tower's attacks. If the tower targets you, fall back out of range. God Ymir has joined the fight. Defeat him and move on to the enemy Phoenix. He looks cool. Enemy gods are a greater threat and are usually controlled by enemy players. You should defeat this god before moving on. First blood. Ahead is the enemy Phoenix, which can only be damaged by your basic attack. Once destroyed, all of your minions in this lane will spawn with upgraded weapons. Deal more damage. Unlike towers, a phoenix will eventually respawn. Destroy the enemy phoenix, but remember. Yeah, enough! I will handle it myself! <laughs> With Neath on my side, you have no chance. <sighs> we shall see. Storm into the enemy base and destroy their titan to win. Oh, you can master heroes in this too? Yeah, yeah, I feel, yeah, you can, yeah, you can master heroes. What's the draw distance on this? About right there, huh? Okay.
Oh, you get all her abilities on low. What is that one? Nope, I just used the meditation. Man, I can't. Bull Demon King. Oh, okay, that's an escape. Oh, okay. AOE. There we go. Ooh. Oh, it's Murdoch's night. Okay. What is going on in the server? What is going on? What are you talking about, zombie? I don't know if he was exactly talking to me or not, but it's definitely something's going on. So is it just, is it just auto equipping stuff for me? I think. I not have enough for it. Oh, auto purchase is on. Uh, how do I turn it back?
What did I last send to you? Oh, zombie, I was talking about last night. Um, aren't you Blimey Gamer in the YouTube, buddy? On YouTube, aren't you Blimey Gamer? I'm pretty sure you're Blimey Gamer if you're watching, man. Blimey, uh, if you're a Blimey Gamer in YouTube, yesterday when um, you encouraged people to dislike the video, you said, let's see how many dislikes we can get. And uh, then we ended up getting 12 dislikes. Uh, if that's, that's what I was talking about. Like, after you had said that, about 15 people disliked the video, man. Oh, yeah, I forgot about my ultimate. I didn't realize I had my ultimate. Oh, it's a lock-on, too. Okay. me I command you oh shit what she just turned around I didn't say anything dude somebody probably took my name um, how do you hell you go back again? Here we go. Oh, uh, I didn't know he was laughing about it. I wasn't paying attention to it. The only thing I saw is that, uh, so, uh, somebody named Blimey Gamer, uh, which I'm thinking it was him, uh, put in there. Uh, let's see how many dislikes we can get. But he said that he didn't see it. So if you didn't see it, blind me. It's cool, man. It's cool, dude. We'll just call it that.
Right. That's yeah, and that's what you normally say. Uh, and I thank you for providing that feedback to people that watch. Uh, but yesterday, yesterday, uh, we were already up to four dislikes, and uh, um, maybe I'd miss all, but I'm pretty sure I saw uh, your name say that. Let's see how many dislikes that we can get on the video, and then all of a sudden we got 11 damn dislikes. Oh shit, 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 shit. So they just got a single lane. That's crazy. That wasn't even like the full thing. Uh, yeah, uh, Yamur, or, yeah. He looks pretty cool. Let me try him out. Also have the best selection of defensive and crowd control units. Their job is to initiate. Be hungry. Damn, they got one v one. Well, there you go. Paragon can learn a thing or two about that. Make one v one lanes and shit. You'd be like, oh, 1v1 me, man. Yeah, dude. Hey, what's up, brother? What's up, brother? I do remember that, but I don't think it was him. It wasn't him? All right, zombie, it wasn't you. But somebody, somebody, I thought I saw, I thought it was you, zombie. I'll have to go back through and try to look through all the comments, but... Yeah, man, I was just like, damn, like, we had 40 people up in here watching yesterday. I think it was, uh... Some other account named Blimey Hater or something. Oh, was it Blimey Hater? Alright, my bad. But I do remember that because somebody, somebody did say that. But. Yeah, like somebody said that shit and then we got, we had, we had over 30 people in here watching yesterday and then that happened. I was like, fucking, <laughs> and, you know, it just, it get discouraging, you know, like, it's just like, man, like, it does. Uh, how do you take it off of auto or leave it on? going on bye all right yeah because see you see your uh, your things at the bottom right like your abilities <laughs> yeah so you can set it on auto Auto like purchase where it automatically level up itself, or you get to choose which which 
which one you want to level up first, like your wall and shit. See, like you kind of like if you you like steel, like that's your main character probably. So you would probably like somebody like Ymir or like. Oh, he puts up a wall. Yeah, and then okay. who is a uh, is a uh, like a frost breath? It stuns people. And like it shards him in ice, and then his ex is like um he throws out like icicles and stuff on the ground, and that that applies to slow and it does damage. And then his ultimate, he crawls up until like he just like smashes the ground kind of, and he br he brings out this big radius of ice, and it slows people and it does major damage. So the wall could be like a, a defense shield. Or it can like, you know, help you uh, catch up to somebody, like you can put a wall in front of somebody. Okay. That's why I try to tell people, most people, most, I like Paragon too, but most people that say they, they don't, they like Paragon better than Smite is because Paragon was the first MOBA they played. Smite, Smite is much more, I wouldn't say complicated, but it's, it's much more skillful, much more deeper and impactful and like meaningful from a MOBA standpoint that you gotta do. Yeah. Tower diving and stuff? Tower diving? Nah, you, you can't do that shit in Smite. If you do, you gotta be smart with it. Like, I saw like when you doing a tutorial, that tower, that tower hit you for 300. Hell yeah, that's why I left. I saw that, I was like, nope. <laughs> so hold on, press. Alright, I'll need to go back. Purchase Spirit Tier 3. Okay. See, your relics at the bottom, uh, those are free. You can upgrade those. That's something they brought back uh, to, to Smite. You can upgrade your relics. So, like, you got stuff like the med, the meditations that can heal you and allies and give you mana, the little beads, the purification. Let's say you get caught in a CC, you can immediately pop that where that way you don't have no CC effects at all. Mm. Like, for instance, if you got Hades, and I got Hades in the game, if he comes in and he does his, his ultimate is like a, a pool. He, like, pulls you in to, like, kind of like his realm. You can immediately pop the purification bees and get out of it, so you won't be, like, continue. It's like a Gideon all, basically. That's what Hades does. Yeah. So, hold on. Tell me, tell me this. So, I only got the one tree that I can go up in or something or what? What do you mean one tree? Like, it's got, okay, it's got core, damage, defensive, relic. Oh, yeah, you, you need to go to the top, press R1. Like, when you're in when you're in the base, you need to press R1 to go, like, popular and shit like that. You should be able to go over. It might be limited to you, though. Since you still in this tutorial, so but you, st you still should let us go over. Like if you go to the very, very top, you see, yeah, uh, and it'll tell you like your boots. The boots in this game is what you really want to buy first. So and like you gotta read. If you look at the right, it'll tell you what the stats are for each item that you want to buy. Like it'll tell you like if it gives you ability armor, if it gives you attack speed, and like each one has like its own like. A uh, unique perk that it can have. And see your boots in this game, like that's what you want to buy first. Cause that's what makes you. That's what gives you movement speed on most of Oh, Okay. See what you want to do with your mirror. Sometimes you want to try to put up your wall, try to block them off. You want to hit circle, or freeze and stun them. Throw out your X, and then if you can, you know, do your ultimate. You press triangle, and then the longer the longer he stays there, the bigger it gets, and you can like maximize the whole circle. Or you can pop it off quickly if somebody's like almost dead. You can press triangle, and then they're almost dead. Press it again. I think you're you're more of a so like you play Paragon. You like people like Steel. Uh, if you like Kalari, you probably you would love um so like you would love <coughs> Cali, you like yeah. Kalari pretty much. There's people in this game that you love on Paragon, like Kalori, like if somebody like, you know, in the AO Kong or somebody like Kali, and then if you like <coughs> or somebody like Yamil or uh, Ares, good pick, you got Kuzumbo. Who else you play with a lot? I'm trying to think if they got anybody like Revenant.
It just, it just came out with a new guy too recently. <coughs> Excuse me. Like Phase. They got Aphrodite in the game that links on the people. Oh, okay. Like Phase, pretty much. Um, who else? Oh yeah, if you like Sparrow, Artemis is in the game. Like Artemis is pretty much a Sparrow, pretty much. And you usually play Twin Blast or Carry or Revenant. I'm trying to think if they got anybody who likes that. <laughs> Dude, beating ass. Look at him. I wonder if they. I want. I'm gonna email High Res and see if I have to rebuy everything on another system. Cause I I own all the heroes on Xbox One. I own them all. Oh, they might. I don't know. They might give. I don't know. <clears throat> they might. Well, see, the good thing about this, like, you know, which is best about all the characters, but usually High Res makes it where they have free rotate. They got a thing on here called free rotation, where if you don't have the character, like, they do these things called free rotation, where you get to try out, like, maybe 10 characters that you don't have. And you can actually buy heroes. Uh, in the game with the little slight favors that you get for yeah. the gems. So. Yeah, I'm trying out Smite, buddy. Just trying it out. <clears throat> you'll like it once. You'll, you'll like it. You just gotta understand, like, just the, just the whole concept design of it. The sun has risen once again. I see Thor's pretty good too. I see Ra, yeah, Ra's, Ra's like a caster, so he's he's like a, he's a caster and a healer. Oh, they picked my boy so bad, so bad. Oh yeah, you see, uh, you see Cali on your team. Who? Cali. Cali. Oh, okay. I, I see. Who's that? She's kind of like she's kind of, she's kind of like Kalari. She can throw like daggers and kind of like blades and like she can jump and stuff like that. How you doing? She's kind of like a she's kind of like a mini Kalari. Yeah, I hear you, man. Absolutely horrible. We got put up against the same team twice and I've just been countless times and people keep saying I suck on my servers. I'm solo queuing. Yeah, I think to get uh to play rank mode, you gotta have like ten people at least mastered level one. Oh well. Yeah. It's not like mastery, like, you just gotta get him ranked up one time, that's it. Yeah, I'm playing Smite. Wow. Uh, yeah, just trying it out. That's why I tried to tell you a long time ago. It's weird if you branch out and play. You know, Paragon will always be life and love. It's always good to branch out and play something else because you can get more people in here. Like the people that maybe only like Smite and don't like Paragon, you can open up your community and be like, oh hey, you might find some new people that come in here and be like, oh you play Smite. So you even got somebody to come in and say this game is hard when compared to the dumbed down version of Paragon we have. This, this game is like more. Once you understand this game, you're gonna appreciate what High Res has done with this game. And this is what I expect Paragon to be like, but with better graphics. Because I give Paragon the benefit of the doubt. Smite is a fully completed game. I mean, these graphics are fine, though. I mean, Smite graphics are actually really good. They're not bad. Yeah, it's just not. I wish he would attack faster, though. Yeah. You gotta put attack speed on him if you want him to attack faster. And see, when you pick the abilities, you gotta read, like, what they do with that. Because sometimes you can, like, some stuff stacks. Like, there's a lot of different stuff in the game. And I have to go through and read the patch notes and tell you, like, what's good and what's not. Because how res, like, does frequently updates to balance stuff. Because there's so many damn gods in the game. And see, I think Epic's gonna do the same thing Smite does. 
with Paragon. See, I think Smite, it's like every two months or so they release a god, or every three months. So I think eventually after the game, you can take that route. And I thought I would release those every three weeks like they've been doing. Yeah, that little circle you put out, like his little uh, light shit, that heals people. That heals people and allies who stand inside the circle. Yeah, I was looking at that. Minions have reached our portal. What? Yeah, see, this is arena. This is like, I would say, it could be hard for it, but it's more of a casual stuff. The little portals you got on, like, minions get in there, you lose points. You start out at 500, whoever gets to zero, lose it. So, uh, if you kill an enemy guy, you get five points. Minions go through, they give you a point. And then you got buffs on the on the left and right side. So if you need a tax speed, you need to go to the, uh, to the purple camp. No, release me! I command you. I think you yo, you just use it. Man. So if you ever need buffs, go to the left or right side. You'll see a mannequin. That's the blue one. That's the lizard thing. The one in the middle is the tiger. That's the red can. That's the red one. They give you more damage, and then you got attack speed can. Oh, okay. And see, another thing that people get confused on the Paragon of Smite. See, Paragon Epic allows you to stack buffs. Smite, you can't do that. You get one buff. That's how they made a balance. You get one buff, and that's it. Now, like, if you got a blue buff already, and you go get another blue buff, it'll refill the blue buff that you already had. But you can't, you know, uh, a mana buff on top of a red buff. You can't do that. Oh, so I can't get another another one of these beast camps then and only do one at a time? Nah, if you don't, if you, if you got a buff, you'll know it'll be around your waist. It'll be like red or blue. But if you don't have nothing around your waist, that's how you know if you got a buff. That's shockwave, though. Oh, shit. God damn. Guan Yu ain't no joke. Yeah, Guan Yu, yeah, Guan Yu, he got a, yeah, he's got a major attack speed, and he's got a thing where he can heal allies, too. Yo, Roth Ultimate, your triangle is crazy. It's like Piccolo, special beam cannon, that shit is awesome. I see, I see you getting blue buff right now, man. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, I think your, uh, your comp should be like one of the directional buttons, I think. They might have changed it. Oh, shit. Went a little too far. You got a lot of gold, too. I don't even know where my gold is at, man. At the bottom, uh, uh, look at the bottom, uh, stuff. magical protection, magical lifesteal. Yeah, see, damage. See at, the, um, see at the bottom left, down at the bottom left hand side. Of the yeah, I see that. Gold, yeah, 3,000. Yeah, that's how much gold you got. Anytime you play with somebody like Raw, anybody who does like you know. Casters, like you know, how you play with Faye, Gideon, and all that. Anybody who does casting and ability, you want to buy the purple boots. They're called the Maggie boots. They give you magical penetration, magical power, and I think it gives you a little bit of movement speed. You want to buy those on all your casters in Smite. And then if you go with somebody more physical, you want to buy the, uh, the Warrior Tabo boots. Minions have reached your fortress. Oh, you about to kill him? Yeah, he did. I get my boy so bad. I like so much.
And you probably already tell if you look on the right when you're in the store and you look on the right hand side, it'll tell you like what it does, like magical penetration, magical power. Yeah, I was looking at that. Desolation of Spear, this shit is a beast. Damn, they had a co op versus AI in this game? Wow. No way. Cause I remember the comment yesterday because you you laughed about it yesterday. I don't know if you remember. Yeah, I remember the comment. I was just like, wow, like, yeah, I remember the comment, dude. Cooper. Well, I think I just hit a milestone on the screen, bro. What'd you hit? Damn. Once I get the 50,000 coins, I'm gonna retire. It's like, no, I'm playing. <laughs> get my money and I'm going, coach. Get my money and I'm going, coach. <laughs> and see, that's one reason why I wanted you to try Smite, because you told me that Paragon was your first mobile, and I'm like, all right, I'm like, I know how smart you are and what you can do. I'm like, if you can't even get into smite and you understand the concept and understand the build that you can make and the creativity it has, and like, there's so many guys you can never, like, you don't know who to pick. And there's so many different game modes, you know, you make somebody get mad or whatever, you can go 1v1 somebody. Like, this is Call of Duty. Well, you ain't got no man. Yeah, I see that. Ooh, you know, you know, oh, damn. I'm unstoppable. Oh, that man. So you play with Scotty and Scotty is a monster. The crit, Scotty is like Scotty is a monster. See, I don't know if they're ever introduced. Who is talking just curious? Oh, that's Shockwave, buddy. That's Shockwave from the string. I don't know if Par I don't know if Paragon will ever introduce stuff like that. But like they got heroes on like Smite, like Scotty. She got like Ted Wolf. But I don't know if like Paragon will ever introduce people like that to have like a sidekick with them. There's another character, uh, another god named Erlog Slaw Erlog Schlang. He got like a dog. He chewed that mother. Oh. Double kill. <laughs> oh, look at Titus twelve and three. Oh yeah, and you see that big dude carrying that ball? Yeah. If you get him through the portal, that gives you 15 points. So it takes 15, 15 uh, points away from the enemy team. And each, I think, those spawn every. Um, oh, this big ass dude. Yeah, the escort. Yeah. We, 
when you get when you get him in there, it takes off 15 points. So that's that's huge if you play arena. I agree with him. I, mean, I, I know Paragon when it fully comes out, it'll be what it's supposed to be. I'm hoping, but damn, they shut me down. Release me, I command you. Um, let me look at this band ability so I know which one I'm doing. If you uh, uh how you call the people. It's a uh, right directional button, and then like you got like triangle. You, you got emotes you can do like. So a lot of the emotes are free too, so you don't really gotta worry about buying emotes on the game. Triple kill! I wish Paragon had these mechanics, man. Graphics aren't that bad, but Paragon just, yeah. And see, I don't know if you ever heard it, but I got some videos. When the motherfucker uh, on this game says Pentacue, yeah, you will never ever hear nothing like it. Like the dude <laughs> into it in this game. Like it is incredible. Like Paragon, he, he just like Pentakill. Like the dude on this game, yo, he gets into it. Like he. <laughs> It's amazing! Yeah, like when you uh, get a kill in this game, the dude screams. He'd be like, Quadra kill. I'm like, what? Yeah, see, on my game, L3 is how you jump, so I got like my settings completely. L3, L3 is your jump? Yeah. It used to be X. It used to be X for me on Xbox, but I don't know. I'll, I'll leave it at these and play with these uh, settings. Uh, am I just doing this over and over again? You can skip. You can skip the tutorial. How do I get out of it, though? I can't get out of this now, can I? Well, it's over now. Like the world, I see it on the screen. The match is over. Right, the match is over, but when I first played this, I, I didn't even do the tutorial. What I did is I just went straight to like well, I played like one or two conquest games, but I went into arena and played. Maybe like 20, 25 games in arena just to get just to get a couple of heroes that I like. That's what you want to do. You want to find out the heroes that you like and you know, your strengths and stuff, and you want to get used to the builds and stuff. But like arena, arena is just like the TDM deathmatch where like it's kind of like more laid back, casual, and then you got clash. Clash is like mini conquest where you got two lanes and you got like a little small jungle, and then you got the one v one game modes. You got um. They got some PVE stuff, like adventures and stuff that'll be coming out, and then you have the 5v5 conquest. Like, you would probably like this dude named Bacchus on the team. Like, he belly flops on people and knocks them up in the air, and you get like a stun, and he can burst on people and stuff. I think I've seen Anthony as like a giant ass turtle or something. Oh, yeah, his name's Kuzumbo. Big turtle dude? Yeah. Yeah. He ain't really that good though. Yeah. Uh, I could return to lobby. All right. Let's see what it has for me now. I think I was just doing the same training shit over and over again. Yeah, it's probably gonna take you through like all of the most of the modes. Try to get you familiar with it. Yeah. Cause I'll let you know in this game when you first get into the store, your core stuff is like you know simple stuff. Most of the time, your core stuff is like armor and ability armor, like physical armor, ability armor. You know, but on here they call it, like physical protection and stuff and magical protection. And your boots, like that's what you really want to buy, like in the beginning, because most of the boots give you either cooldown reduction and most of them give you movement speed. Some of them give you magical power and mana. And then if you're playing like a like a fighter, like a melee sure. person, you want to get like you know probably the warrior tab eye boots, because that gives you uh, attack speed, movement speed, and I think it gives you crit chance. So you gotta be for you to even play against. Other people, you gotta be ranked 30. Jesus. No, I don't think so. Is it? That's what it says. Rank mode unlocks at level 30. Oh yeah, rank mode. Yeah, rank. Yeah, you. Oh. Yeah, you can't even access rank like until you like get like at least 10 master 
ten people, ten heroes at level one master. There's ten Damn. Heroes at master. That's crazy. And they got skin. Like when you, once you hit rank ten, you get like a diamond skin. So how smites like or not smite, but paragons like more of like um, you know the like the fiery mastery skin. Like most of all smites is like diamond. Like you're completely diamond. Oh, this is just versus, alright, so I get that. Ranks. Joust. A dual lane, 5v5 five five maps. All jungles here. There. You should Arena. Do anything once you're done with the tutorial. But yeah, you might have to contact high res to see you. I don't know. They might. I don't know. They'd probably be like, well, it's a different system, so you probably have to buy the game. I think it's just like 10 bucks. No, it's. It's more than ten dollars. This shit cost me like twenty. Let me see here. Come on, it might be like it might be ten bucks now. The ultimate yeah, god pack. Time. Yeah, one time person purchase thirty bucks, refunded with purchase. Gotta play rank for a while. That'd be something like way way later on down the road. I'm good with Kabrakin now. Don't fuck with me. Double kill. Arena and see some of the maps they redid recently, like Clash, like maybe I think six months ago, they redid the whole map. Now it's Egyptian based now. Oh, you dead, bro. It's <laughs> 8 no. You dead. But something to start you out to get like simple mechanics to the game and learn the buffs and stuff, I would probably play Arena. Or you can play Clash if you want to kind of get used to like a mini conquest. Clash yeah. will teach you. It's a two, two lane map. Hey, we got eight people watching. If we can get eight more likes on the video, we greatly appreciate it. Uh, wow, there's a lot of guys. Hell yeah, there's I think there's like eighty or that might not be that many. I think it's close to eighty. It's worth it though. I think the new guy just came the new guy just came out recently. I had so much money on me I forgot. I wonder why it's L3 is down there. Oh, I'm trying to think like, I don't know, I don't know like what you like, like best in a MOBA, I don't, like you more like, you like tank people, right? Yeah, I, I mean, I like, I don't know, I, I like, I like anybody, I'll play anything. That's the other thing about Smite, they got a lot of different, they got the Assassin, they got the Hunter, they got the Guardians, which is basically the tanks, and you got the Mage, which is basically cast. and I forgot the other one. But see, in this game too, it's, it's just like Paragon, like, if you if you play a Guardian that's supposed to be a tank, you can make him a hybrid, you know, because you got six slots that you can put on. You can put three damage uh, three damage items on, and you can put, like, you know, three support things on where you can get health and, like, cooldown reduction. Yeah. That's why I try to tell people, like, you, you could be one of the people, and, like, some of the other people in the stream can do it, too, but, like, you try to come from, like, Paragon, hey, it's gonna take some to get used to, because Paragon, especially now, Paragon is, like, a lot more dumbed down. This, it takes, you just, you got a lot of, like, thought process to do in this game. Especially like buffs and stuff. Also, you rock. I'm the greatest. Woohoo, Barry. When the hell did I get a blue buff? 
Good luck. Have fun. Hi. Awesome. I think you would like family with too. Man, we beat the shit out of this team. Yeah, I'm playing some smite, Mr. Collector. Trying something different, man. I just I just lost eight games in a row in Paragon. Took my Elo from one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I just lost eight games in a row in Paragon. I went from I went from 1480 down to 1402, dude. I was just like, fuck it. Like, I was, I was fucking four matches away from hitting platinum again. Damn, these dudes are like masters. Look at this shit. They got shit all around her. They're fucking, I can't even tell what gods are which or what, what gods I'm playing against, shit. Mr. Collector says Smite is good, bro, but Paragon is better. See, I don't know about that. See, when people say Paragon is better, like, I, that's why I try to tell people to explain on what. People always say graphics. I'm like, graphics, graphics don't make the game more mobile. Oh, damn, look, the cards and shit are moving. Yeah, you get like different backgrounds and stuff, banners and stuff like that, and you can like show your stats. Like it actually shows your stats. Like I just got a triple kill. Motherfuckers came out on me. I only played the game like six months. I would give I would give Paragon a bit. If Paragon could be what it was, and they can like make it how I think they can make it, it'd be better than smiting every other mode right now. Like back when Paragon first came out, when it had uh, when it had harvesters and stuff like that, Paragon was on the point of being the greatest MOBA that has ever existed. And then they, they yep, yeah. straight they fucked it up. Mess. And they they still keep it. Like it's just like all they gotta do. That's why I know it's gonna be a good. It's gonna be a good game when they when it fully comes out. Like right now, this is people gotta understand too. Even I understand. It's just not a lot of cards in the game. That's the reason why people keep using Growth Totem and all these other cards. It's, let Paragon get 40 cards in each affinity. You won't be having these cards. And they also need to change it where, uh, like fucking, uh, like rejuvenated and stuff like that. Like health, like you know, rewards. They shouldn't take up a card slot. It needs an extra slot on the side instead of taking up a whole card slot. Paragon, uh, I ain't even alone. When Paragon came out, I stopped playing Smite. Damn. I'm like rank 60, I'm like rank 69 on Smite, I think. I stopped playing, uh... I stopped playing Smite. Cause I actually enjoyed it. I still I enjoy Paragon, but it's just lately. Paragon just uh, I don't know, it's just not that fun. Like I can't even play on my main because literally every Q tone takes between thirty, like or like twenty to thirty minutes for a Q tone. Yeah, Thanatos is a monster in this game too. There's a lot of good players in this game as gods for sure. Trying to do DK with like. Oh shit. Should have just ran away. Shouldn't even had tried to help him. Uh, did you buy any boots for your man? No, I haven't got any boots from him. I saw, it was one of the magical things that gave me a 10% speed boost.
Like that's the cool thing about Smite too, just like how Paragon made it. You put on like let's say you want boots, like usually what I do for like early game, I put on the blue boots. It's called the shoe the shoes of focus and that gives you more mana in the beginning. And then you can sell those boots later to put the purple boots on the magic. The magic boots, they give you magical power and magical penetration. And if you ever want to sell an item, you just go over and you just press uh press square. Should better sell it. God damn. Hey, you got to kill. Like that guy Odin, uh, all he's gonna do most of the